Hello everyone and welcome to Road to PID Innovators with Muhammad Imran. In this video, I will explore exciting journey of pursuing PID or postdoc at University of Gothenburg, Sweden. The University of Gothenburg is a world-class institute that offers a wide range of research opportunities across multiple disciplines. As a PhD or postdoc candidate at this very university, you will have access to cutting-edge facilities and resources that will enable you to push the boundaries of knowledge and make groundbreaking contribution to your field. Let's start the video. This is the main page of this university. You can see that. I will directly go to the vacancies page. University of Gothenburg announced PhD and postdoc uh, positions often on their website. And uh, every position have one to two month gap to apply. So you can directly go to the vacancy page. This is vacancy page here. And uh, I will select a doctoral student here. The multiple faculties are available, faculty of education, faculty of fine, applied and performing arts, faculty of humanities, faculty of science, faculty of social sciences, IT faculties, national unit, and School of Business, Economics and Law and University Library. You can select PID position according to your research background, or academic background. For example, I want to select Faculty of Education. Just click on search. These are the four PID position available on education. The PID student in educational work, the PID student in subject matter, education with specialization mathematics this is PID student in subject matter education with specialization science education and technology and this is another PID position deadline to apply on this position is 3rd of April this year so again if you want to select uh, some other faculty we can click on search and it will take us to the faculty page. Meanwhile, I would also like to show you how you can select or find out the postdoc position. Just click researcher and, and here again, the faculties are available, but I'm selecting any so that all available postdoc position appear to me. These are the postdoc positions available this time. This is in the political science. Again, the postdoc position in political science, researcher and European research, assistant research to department of political science. You can see the most of the positions here in the political science. This is postdoc position in marine biology and this is postdoc position in marine biology as well in bioengineering, microbiology, Research assistant in biomolecular NMR and alpha fold, associate researcher. This is with radiology. So, this is again two postdoc position in marine biogeochemistry. So, these are the available position here. Uh, in you again, if you want to find out the PID position in. Uh, Faculty of Science, this is in the Faculty of Science, the four or five positions are available in inorganic material for direct capture of uh, carbon dioxide from here. Doctor student in marine biogeochemistry and pollution, three PID students are required. And this is PID student in marine ecology, student in membrane homeostasis, and again, in the natural science specialization in biology you can select any of uh, the faculty according to your background uh, if i select any and uh, the list of all available pid positions 
will appear. These are all prior depositions. I am scrolling down one by one so that you can see according to your research interest and research background. So you can see the various PID positions in different fields are available. The deadline is ranging from March to April and May. So if you want to apply on any PID position or any a postdoc position, I have selected one PID position to elaborate the process to you. I have selected a postdoc position, uh, subject area, marine biology, science, bioengineering. This is the topic of that PID postdoc position. This is the project description. Always use project description to create or develop your cover letter or motivation letter. Try to extract the four to five relevant keywords from the project description. For example, they need controlled environment, aquatic food production system. They also looking for hydrophonics and aquaculture and biomicrobial biofilters so these are the keywords that you can extract from this description this is the working environment and these are the qualification you need and here is the application process the cv the cover letter that describe how the applicant meet the selection criteria evidence of strong academic writing skills manuscript peer review journals you can also submit your research articles a copy of PID dissertation a name and contact detail of three referees or you can also provide the PDF to apply on this position just simply click on this apply I will also select a PID position to explain you how to apply on a PID position. This is doctoral student in inorganic material for direct capture of carbon dioxide from air. This is uh, the project detail. And I'm repeating again and again, always use these detail to extract five to six keywords, which you can use in your cover letter or motivation letter so these are the duties this is eligibility yeah requirement here yeah, english is required for this so always check with the english requirement And you need personal letter, CV, diploma, transcript showing your general entry requirement, proof of completion of English, six course or acquiring equivalent knowledge through the previous studies. It means that if you do not have IELTS, TOEFL, you can also provide English proficiency certificate from your previous university. Two letters reference letters you need to provide name email telephone number or relations and uh, here if you want to apply on this position just simply click on apply it will go to to the another page where you need to provide some basic information about yourself uh, just I have already created the account, so I will just log in to the account. Very simple process to apply on such positions. You can see I'm providing my details here and uh, where you see the, you can select this. If you want to, if you have saved your information, you can reuse this information. You can see that here you need to provide the application letter uh, and CV and uh, grades and character certificates uh, you can upload your 
academic certificate here and click on this I consent to my personal data being handled and described in policy and register. Your application will be submitted. There is no need to submit an application fees. There are no read requirement of IELTS. And these are very exciting positions. You must apply on these positions. If you have any query, just put your query in the comment box. Thank you so much. Best of luck.